One more book. I am writing. Written by M. J. Fievre. Illustrated by Jean Patrick Icat Pierre. On their bicycles, Johnny and Junior, the neighborhood kids, sail down the street with great speed. They laugh, giggle, and shout, and the sounds of their rolling voices bounce off the walls of houses and blend into the low hum of Porter Prince. They seem to be having such a good time. I want to ride a bike. Junior and Johnny teach me how to ride a bike. I sit clueless, both feet touching the ground. I imagine myself falling onto the gravel, the tiny stones scraping my skin. You can do it, Johnny says. I stare straight ahead and squeeze the handlebars. I kick off with one foot and lunge forward. Off I go, swimming through the air. The pedals spin freely as I'm sailing ahead. The air is breezing past my face, my arms and legs. The landscape is flowing by me like images on a TV screen. I'm riding downhill, bumpity bumpity bump on Junior's bicycle. My hair is flying behind me. The back continues to pick up speed. What will I do if the brakes fail? I don't even know how to brake. With a slight bump, my tires cross onto the main road. When I swerve right, the bike seizes up like a bucking bronco and trucks roar by. There is a car coming and another car behind it. People on the sidewalk scream at me to get off the road. Raleco, step aside. I'm in the middle of the street and cars behind me are honking. My mouth opens to a scream. A tap tap is coming straight at me. In that blind instant, I imagine the swift pain of the crash, the smack of metal, and the sound of a windshield exploding in a glass shower. But at the last minute, the bus swings out of my way and passes me. Gravel rains next to me like hail. The driver's window is down, and as the tap tap speeds by, I hear the man shouting at me, Fais attention, Tiffy. Watch out, little girl. Somehow, I regain control of the bike. I ride onto the sidewalk and lean my bicycle against the walls of an apartment building. The handlebar scrapes the cement, forcing my bike to slow down. Junior and Johnny come running. Are you okay? I nod and laugh. It was scary, but fun. I want to give it a second try. Junior holds the back of the two-wheeler and then lets go. As soon as he yells, you've got it, the bike wobbles. I forget the brakes again and crash. I crash again and again until it magically happens. I am riding. I even get cocky enough to ride without using my hands, arms folded or ringing the silver bell on the handlebars. I've learned how to ride a bike, I tell my papa. At that moment, I see an old woman on a horse. I want to ride a horse, I shout. My papa rolls his eyes. A horse? Just one more book!